Over the last 12 months, Council has continued to deliver programs that deliver growth for our regional economy and for the residents who live here. This year, Council has delivered in excess of $300 million of operational expenditure for services across the region. As well, we have spent $175 million on capital expenditure, upgrading and renewing the uh, capital assets in the region. We've been able to do this without the need for borrowing, delivering it entirely from revenue and retained earnings. At a time when funding from higher levels of government is increasingly difficult to obtain, we have improved efficiencies and developed ways to deliver ongoing value for money for our residents. Furthermore, Council has delivered an operating surplus of $12 million this year, enabling delivery of new infrastructure across the region. Council is committed to maintaining its existing capital infrastructure valued in excess of $4 billion and carried out comprehensive review and revaluation of three asset classes during this period, including the road enrichment network valued at just under $2 billion. Our financial position is sound and we believe we have delivered the right balance between opportunity and stability, investment and affordability and the risk and responsibility while ensuring ongoing financial sustainability. The financial services team implemented various system improvements to achieve the best financial outcomes for Council and our community, including the introduction of BPayView and email options for rate notices. The half yearly issuing of rate and water notices were completed on schedule and our team has completed 31,290 customer requests and read 124,863 water metres during the year. The rates arrears ratio at the end of the financial year was at 4.21%, which is comfortably below our target of 5%. The procurement team has implemented a system for the paperless onboarding of suppliers, making it easier to do business with Council. 95% of supplier invoices were paid within the agreed payment terms providing confidence to those businesses who serve as Council's needs. Our service improvement team continue to drive innovation with the rollout of the mobility program enabling real-time use of computer systems for our staff while out on the job. Preparation is well underway for the updating of our corporate plan to guide the direction of Council for the next five years. Community consultation will be conducted in late 2018. Technology plays an ever-increasing role in how we do business and this year Council has received close to 25,000 emails and 8,600 dial before you dig requests. Significant and regular cyber security activities were also executed in response to an increasing cyber activity against organisations in Australia. Our governance team oversaw statutory compliance, fraud and corruption prevention audits and provided leadership in the development of a risk management culture. This year, 12 ordinary, 16 committee and 22 special meetings were arranged and conducted to meet our legislative and policy timeframes. Council is committed to remaining financially stable, providing services to our community and to build new infrastructure for now and into the future.